of popular singers of Copeter. And uh, today she is, well, first and foremost in the blues field. Laverne Baker. <laughs> Today, with the passage of time, those cover records are looked upon as absurdities. I mean, who cares about uh, Pat Boone doing a Fats Domino record? It's Fats Domino that counts. Who cares about Bill Haley? The original record has persisted, at least in the consciousness of the public, if not in the sales. It's a rare example in our uh, commercial culture of art winning out over commerce if you wait long enough. Jim Danny was a nickname Dan, uh -huh. luckiest cat in the whole of land. Uh -huh. Love me so well it seems. Uh -huh. In a month she was plumb insane. Uh -huh. Jim Danny got a married. Uh -huh. Love Jim Danny. Love Jim. Danny. If you go with the notion that black music is the hallmark, it's the it's the gravamen of it our culture. Although it was parochial and it stayed in the black community for decades and maybe for centuries and it didn't come out, when it finally did emerge, it captured the sensibility of the whole world. And Elvis Presley was the enunciator. He was the messiah. <laughs> 